I spent the past week in Ireland. Yeah. And the my nana, I went there nice to visit. Nice segue, baseball to that, Ireland. That, well, uh, I'm getting to the point. I know, no, no, just, no I, I know. Let me talk, man. All right. I'm um, sorry, man. I don't want to talk anymore. You were mean to Billy. <laughs> 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 you owe Mr. Corgan an apology. Oh, I thought you were talking about Big w- B- Billy B. Uh, yeah. yeah. Both, both Billy. Yeah. Third person. You've both been Billies. very... No, I, when I refer to myself in the third person, I say daddy. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you'll know. Daddy's mad. Um, so, uh, it was at the same case that when you saved the 13-year-old girl, daddy saved you. That's right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> yeah. yeah and then daddy had to discipline her later, so gave her a whack. Um, so, we go to Ireland, my father, my mother, myself. My mother's mother still lives in Ireland. So, special shout out to all of our Irish fans. Hey, guys. Um, Do you have a lot of family there? How how big is your family there? Uh, not like cousins or? I've got some cousins going to school in Dublin. I've got family living in France. I'm sure there's like distant relatives living in Ireland, but um, really my mom and her mom, or my mom is from Ireland, so her mom. Uh, so you, said, you said Dublin, right? No, 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 no. Uh, we're on the west side of Ireland in County Mayo in a town called Swinford. So would you say that there's like a difference between like a major city and like the outskirts? Yes. Yes, of course. Like he, there is? Like w- the house that we have in town got internet like six months ago. Oh, wow. And we have three channels and <laughs> or like TV channels, you know? Yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, huge difference. But... So around the country, like town population 1,400 and 10, 15 years ago, uh, there used to be like 50 pubs in the town mm-hmm. for the 1,400 people, <laughs> which is a ridiculous yeah, that's like uh, many. ratio. Yeah, that's, that's... That's like the Starbucks. That's quite a few. Um. Yeah, or Subway's. <laughs> yeah. Like a Subway sandwich, Subway sandwich. Um, side note, can I tell a side note? No. Yes, of course you can. Funny thing about Starbucks, I read recently that there were that Starbucks made a policy because of how many motherfuckers are there on their computers that they refu- that they put they I don't know how but they established some kind of firewall where porn is not allowed <laughs> at That's there That's fair. Sure. So major porn companies like Pornhub and X Hamster and shit they banned anybody in the who works for them in the buildings to drink Starbucks. i think that sounds petty because it's fair you shouldn't be watching porn in public right yeah that's who doesn't you know yeah no who does who goes to like the starbucks like yeah i'm gonna grab my my americano just dude sitting when i worked in that logistics office and you're in there eight hours a day what are you you gonna be looking at like your work (laughs) yeah (laughs) yeah i'm serious (laughs) <laughs> were you, were you saying that because you were sitting there watching? No, porn no, because just... I would see people. I, I don't want to get. I don't want to get a boner at work because I don't want to. I'm not going to be able to control it and have to like go I in some right. meeting room and jag. Just happens. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I have to go on break again. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Tom, you sure do go to the bathroom a lot. <laughs> yeah, and you always have some Elmer's glue on you. What? Hey, you're, <laughs> Elmer's glue. <laughs> hey, Pete, why are you sweating so much? <laughs> yes. <laughs> so. We're in this country town. My nana is now in a nursing home, so we'd go and visit her, and she gave me some money to walk around with, you know, like as a gift, like, hey, get something nice for yourself. Mm-hmm. And uh, everything- What, what is the, they use as currency? The euro. The euro, okay. Mm-hmm. So one euro is worth about, I think, a $1.20 okay. American. And is worth like eighty five cents sterling, which I think means British money, but I'm not sure. Mm. But like on the radio, they would say, like you know, eighty eight cents sterling to okay. one euro to. I've always heard $1. sterling $1. is like an adjective. Like, oh, you combed your hair. That's sterling. You look really? sterling. I've, yeah, I've heard it as like sterling silver. Oh, but yeah, I don't. That's all I've heard. Yeah. I, anyway, I don't know. So. Nana gave me some money. I would buy shit, and I would show her, and I'd be so excited. Like, Nana, look at this awesome, awesome blanket I bought. And she'd say, oh, Billy, you know we have plenty of blankets at home. Why didn't you just take one of them? Why are you wasting your money? It's like, oh, Nana, I'm sorry. <laughs> you got roasted by Nana. Yeah, dude, Nana, Nana roast. Was, ah, Billy, you've always been chubby. You know that. 
<laughs> Jesus. Fuck. Those baseball shirts aren't rolling up on you. Hey. <laughs> uh, have you thought about moving to an extra large, boyo? <laughs> so, the reason I'm telling this story is because I bought a sweater, a nice woolen sweater in Ireland. Mm-hmm. And I run to Nana and I show her. I'm like, Nana, look at this sweater. It's lovely, isn't it? And she's like, you know, we've got so many sweaters at home for you to take. I buy your uncles two sweaters and they've never worn them. You should take them. And then my mom and dad like jump into the conversation They're like, no, no, no. His uncles are much smaller than him. Like he would never fit into their sweaters. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, <laughs> like, did I like I'm losing weight? Like, did I like explode? And so I went home and I tried the sweaters and they fit me perfectly. It's like, fuck you guys. Like. I'm I am big in confidence. I'm I work it. Maintain yes. a big presence, <laughs> but I'm not that big of a person. I don't <laughs> yeah. know. And so anyway, that's in summation, that's <laughs> that was my trip to Ireland. Fucking fat Get jokes. R- roasted by net, yeah. Yeah. Well, I I got I got burned on Thanksgiving with a fa- it reminds me of my family issue. Um my so we started playing Jack in the Box on the computer. Yeah, like Kelly's, the fibbage. Yeah, oh, I like that game. Or it's those, so much fun. Types of games. Yeah, yeah, and and yeah, Kelly's family loves them, and we all love them. But my mom, she just wants to talk about how depressing your life is and doesn't <laughs> want to play. <laughs> so, <laughs> so classic she, Ursula. She, so she just starts going around the house, and she started try, like Kelly had like a jacket and then like a hoodie. She starts trying her shit, and I'm like, and everybody's like, "What? what wait, what's you doing? Yeah, what's your mom doing?" And I'm like. Oh yeah, that's that's I guess that's that's what my mom's idea of fun is just try people's clothes on when you go to their house without asking, <laughs> dude. And my brother burned me so bad. He's like, yeah, kind of like you at grandma's in Poland, huh? Because my grandma is just like my mom. They pass on the whole. I'm so depressed, doom and gloom. So while she, my grandma was talking, I I admitted I I completely got naked and tried like full grandma like underwear and everything on and i started dancing <laughs> with her cane in the <laughs> kitchen this is so like a buffalo ba- bill shit putting lotion and baskets and stuff you know yeah, yeah. guy stuff yeah, yeah, yeah it's a polish thing <laughs> so so she burned me pretty bad <laughs> or he burned me pretty bad yeah. uh, <laughs> like don't talk about that yeah leave mom alone she's just trying on your fiance's clothes yeah <laughs> relax but at least I was doing it to be funny, no? Or who knows? I'm a liar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You waken something in yourself. It's so you so actually kind of feel nice. So your mom like went up to like Kelly's closet? No, no. Was like there was just a bunch of like a like everybody had their coats and shit on the seats in uh in the living or in the dining area, and every and she just started. She's like, oh, look at me. You know, <laughs> was she, I don't know. Was she doing? No. Her, yeah, right. I've never seen that before. Yeah. Was she yeah. doing her Kelly impression? I like, no, I don't know. Like pretending to be Kelly, like no, oh, I'm married I, to Phil. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I I don't know what she was doing. It explains a lot about me, doesn't it? <laughs> I I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I, I I don't know what the hell that was about. Grandparents, parents, yeah. they're crazy. <laughs> well. Speaking of family, you you want to hear a funny Gavin story? I sure do, dude. This like when I realized it after I was laughing my ass off, but I was so dude I had a rough ass fucking week because I had trouble at work, which I'll get into. But the other thing was, um, after the, yeah the fucking night after Thanksgiving, you know, like we're Black par- Friday. Yeah, yeah, we're like partying, like like, like we were here late for Thanksgiving, you know, trying to mm. play games and shit. Dude, I don't know. I never got an ear infection, so I don't know what it feels like. Dude, I wake up in the middle of we, we got drunk and we ended up watching You and Gavin? Oh, uh, sure. no, no. <laughs> <laughs> that was a different night. Yeah, we got drunk and just watched <laughs> Gavin. Yeah, no. I no, but we um me uh like like the whole family we were getting a little messed up and then everybody left and me and Kelly were going to watch uh, Mystery Science. We mm-hmm. watched this really fucking weird movie. I think I liked it more cuz it was weird and not funny. It was called fun in balloon land and it's uh i don't even know if it's really a movie it's it's just <laughs> there's a shitload of people who have built you know like balloon uh people uh, like in parades yeah like, like there's like a, floats uh, yeah yeah floats there's just they had access this movie it seemed like this director had access 
to every fucking float you could picture. Like, oh, I want a Pinocchio with a Santa hat and a sword in his hand. And then they <sighs> built that float into a story, into the story somehow. And then, oh, we have a caterpillar with, uh, y- you know, a gun, and we're going to build this into the story. And the whole movie is these kids walking up to these random floats, and then there's like a dubbed voice like, hello, I'm holding this gun. I don't know why, but it's good for protection. So that's why. Like, it was, <laughs> it was, it was really messed up. Like, is this a recent movie? No, no. Th- I mean, it's Mystery Science Theater. Oh. So, so it's so Got I it. yeah, and and then in between they keep clicking to a parade of like Philadelphia, and all the fucking band members are off. And, like it looks like they they you know oh right. here comes the mentally challenged area of the parade. <laughs> no, but like. All right, that was too bad. I'm sorry, <laughs> I, I I don't know how else to explain don't it. Don't apologize to us. Apologize to the listeners. <laughs> I apologize <laughs> to our loved ones in Ireland. And will you apologize for using midget earlier? <laughs> that was yeah. such a What's the proper ago? word? Yeah, uh, little person. Little person. Little person. I believe. Or just person. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Height just challenged. Like, hey, buddy. No, don't say that. No. I, oh. I call everyone buddy, but there's a comic who says don't do that. Don't call people buddy? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Homie? Uh, I, 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 yeah, Chum? Let's, do, let's, let's go to homie. Chum. Let's yeah, do that. homie. Instead. Homie is the politically correct My term. My drugs. <laughs> Can have some Maloko. <laughs> yeah. No, yeah. No, but uh, any, anyways, so like I go to, like I'm like, ha- you know, pretty drunk watching this weird movie. I'm like, I'm going to have some fucking crazy nightmares. Dude, middle of the night. Y- you know when people cry? They, it's like a high pitch <laughs> and then a low pitch. It's like, <laughs> well, I hear, <laughs> like constantly moving up. And I wake up, and I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Am I hal- like hallucinating some right. shit from this movie? And Gavin was screaming, crying, because he had like some ear infection. So I couldn't get any sleep that like it fucked up my sleep for our, the whole, you know, four day vacation. Uh, and I just keep hearing. <laughs> and I'm and I keep thinking, I'm like, dude, is this like some shining dream where some little girl <laughs> got her lollipop taken away? Because that's what it sounded like. Like, it's, is there some ghost? And then I hear it's the ear infection thing. But the funny thing was like all that day I was so fucking pissed. Then later. I, and he kept going, it hurts, it hurts, but it hurts. I go to drive him to Taekwondo <laughs> and like later that day. And um, I don't know what I ate, but I tore horrible ass in the car. It smells, we, it smells, yeah, yeah, it yeah. smells. We, we run out of the car. We run because we're late, late and we come back later. It's like, oh, it smells, it smells, it's still in here. <laughs> like, <laughs> God, it's like. <laughs> oh, Poor <man>. Gavin. Yeah, <laughs> Gavin's no good. Very bad. No. He's gonna fucking completely hate me when he grows up and watches these. <laughs> 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 but yeah, that's that's the Gavin that, story. That, I don't, have you guys ever had an ear infection? I'm yeah. sure I had a ton when I was a kid. I don't I think so. I mean, I don't remember having like. I think the worst pain I ever had as a kid was like when you had like a fever flu. You know. I feel like every kid at some point gets an ear infection, like young, like three, four. I, d- I don't think I ever had, yeah. No. Uh, like, all right. Maybe I don't. <laughs> <laughs> You're just wrong, man. I don't May know. I, <laughs> yeah. All right. No, I don't know. It sounds bad. very common. I just, I just, I was lucky. However, I did get kidney stones. When you were a kid? No. As an adult, I was just like, I'm oh. like the kid of adults. So. Sure. <laughs> Yeah, kidney and what that was rough. like the most painful. It was yeah. I had to go to the hospital. It and was like what bad. they gave you a morphine drip, and they're like, "All yeah. right, yeah, basically." Yeah, nothing here's painkillers. Have fun, yeah, sport. There's nothing that you can do about. Well, there is, but the the, the operations like, like it's like super expensive sound waves that get shot into your body and right. shatter them. But it's like tens of thousands of dollars, something ridiculous. It's not sound affordable. waves. Is it? Is it a? <laughs> Get fucked up, dude.